Satnam, thank you so much for joining. Welcome to my channel. My name is Jean, and this is going to be a hmm, collective reading. So take what resonates, leave what doesn't. So I'm getting this energy of somebody, uh, like, you know, wings clip kind of vibe. I'm getting, there was somebody in your life that, um, I don't want to say made you, but kind of like maybe gave you false promises or something like that, um, that kind of made you in some kind of way, like lower yourself, like, like, I don't want to say lower your standards, but like maybe lowered your divinity. Um, at some point you were in like a very high vibration, but then this person came through with some kind of karmic energy being like, Hey, boo, but you pataka. And then like, they left you out in the cold. Okay. Uh, so I feel like this is a reading on that. So let's see what's happening there. Interesting. Like an angel coming down from heaven because they prayed for you. And then when, once you got to them, they treated you super, super duper shit. Yeah, like I'm hearing somebody prayed for you. And when you when you like went back down to them for them or something, they kind of rejected you again. And they thought they would be like, ha -ha, ha -ha, I'm getting that energy. But it turns out that's not the case. Like it's not like, nah, bro, something like that. Let's see. The Two of Swords reverse... The Five of Swords reverse. Yeah, like, I feel like this didn't pan, pan out the way this person had hoped, okay? I feel like this person, like, really tried to dismantle your confidence is what I'm hearing. The Nine of Wands reverse. And it didn't work out the way that they wanted to. This person wanted you to... I'm feeling somebody wanted you to continuously fight for them as well as what I'm feeling, okay? What? Um, <laughs> the Seven of Swords. Yeah, somebody was very deceptive towards you. Um, false promises, I'm telling you. Somebody, somebody came through with this energy of like, listen, if you like, if you come down, I'll like love you and I'll, I'll be there for you and da 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 da. And then when, when you got, when you got there, because you are good, because you have such a beautiful heart, right? You're all about forgiveness and shit like that. Um, this person was like, haha, motherfucker, got you. Okay. I feel like this was part of this person and their family or their friend group's plan or some shit like that. Um, and now I feel like these people are in some kind of nine of swords or this person is in some kind of nine of swords because either you're glowing up or you're still beautiful. You're, you're just powerful. Get into the bag, you know, that kind of vibe. Somebody really thought they had one over on you is what I'm hearing. High priestess, the magician, maybe even like a karmic couple, ace of cups, but like you're healing. And again, now this karmic couple is in some kind of situation and somebody fell in love with you is what I'm feeling, yeah? Ugh, this is so childish. Like, this person knows that they made the wrong choice, but it's like, but you knew you were being a dick or something like that. So, like, what are you trying to do? Like, you knew you were being an asshole is what I'm feeling, okay? The hangman might be dealing with the Pisces, okay? Um, I feel like this person is stuck in some kind of spiritual limbo, because of how they treated you. Because they know they like like you gave them a second chance or something like that, and they fucked it up royally, is what I'm feeling here. Ten of Pentacles. They might have done this uh for money or due to like uh stability or family or something like that. Um but I feel like that that's you as well. Like 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 I feel like this person is stuck in spiritual limbo because like the plan didn't pan out and you're doing really well for yourself, okay? Or you're about to fucking do really well for yourself. I feel like you're manifesting something really beautiful for yourself. Your confidence is increasing. Your uh, money is increasing. Your beauty, I feel like, is increasing. Your spiritual power is increasing. And this person is like, what the fuck? Because I feel like, like I'm hearing they dropped the ball multiple times, Seven of Swords, by being in some kind of petty-ass bullshit energy with you. It's like, like, like you gave somebody the benefit of the doubt, okay? Fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, shame on me. Kind of energy. You gave them the benefit of the doubt. You gave somebody a second chance and they just like royally fucked up. <sighs> the high priestess. Yeah, I feel like, listen, if the Hierophant reverse, okay? 
and the Princess of Swords reversed. I feel like because the Ace of the Ace of Cups, Emperor reversed, Six of Swords, Eight of Swords, Ten of Swords reversed the Hermit, Seven of Swords. I feel like this person is like keeps rethinking and reliving the way, like the moment or something that they dropped the ball or something like that. Okay, because again, like I feel like you came in with such like love. You came in with so much forgiveness. This was definitely a family. They definitely chose some kind of family situation over you and there's a bunch of people walking past my home now they definitely like they prayed for you to have cups reverse and then when you got to them when you were like yes boo um you know what i forgive you i i i love you uh let's have this new beginning they put a fucking death to that and they thought this was gonna kill you king of wands queen of queen of pentacles judgment i feel like these people are under judgment now um, because it's like, what the fuck? Like, 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 who are you even, bro? Like, you know, like, why do this? I feel like because they did this, um, you had, you received some kind of like higher spiritual knowledge. I feel like the re like they did this to you and God was like, damn. And then God sent through some kind of like, I'm hearing a spiritual saving grace, ace of swords. You might be starting to connect very intensely with divinity. You might be starting to connect very intensely with the divine, with angels, with aliens, with fucking your higher self, whatever it is. Okay. And I feel like this person, nine of swords, strength this person was not expecting you to be as strong as you are i feel like somebody literally tried to murder your um the star reverse six of pentacles somebody literally tried to murder your confidence so that it would be easier for them to come towards you for the third time or for the fifth time for some of you is what i'm feeling but i'm feeling that this person is recognizing that this is some kind of very major loss of an opportunity I feel like this person is Ten of Cups. Yes, this person is turning against their family, against their hierophant, against their beliefs, their group or something, because they're recognizing that this this family or these people, this uh group or belief or whatever was exactly the thing that made them act in such a harsh, judgmental, or like very icky, icky, icky way, okay? What an icky energy. Eight of Swords. I feel like this person is stuck. This person is in mental um, prison because of them dropping dropping the ball consistently on you. But again, I feel like, like this was no accident. This was planned. The Star Reverse, Six of Pentacles, Ace of Swords. Like somebody wanted to stop your healing just so that they could just so that they could come towards you, just so that they could reject you. If this hasn't happened yet, I feel like this is going to be happening. So be aware of that, okay? I feel like it happened already. But now these people, this person is facing judgment because they were a dick to you. They were a dick to a high priestess. It's They, they might even be facing karma. They might even be thinking that you did something to them uh, because of the way they treated you, because of their karma, yeah? Um, and I feel like you gave this person multiple chances. For some of you, it was just two chances. As well as that I'm getting. For some of you, it was just one. <laughs> like for some of you, you literally lowered your standards for somebody and then they did this to you. I, I didn't feel like that. I feel like you loved this person though because otherwise you wouldn't have um, gone towards them, right? But but you like I feel like you you came down in some kind of way you like came down from heaven in some kind of way or the sun as I'm saying that you did something um, I don't want to say that was out of character but you kind of like you compromised a whole lot on yourself to give this person what you feel like they needed and deserved but once you gave that to this person this person took it and ran. What an asshole! Oh my, the devil! What a fucking asshole! This person is chained to the devil now. This person is being haunted. I'm hearing haunted by the memory of you. And if I can't be close to you, I'll settle for the ghost. Ugh, I miss you more than love. I feel like this person is like really feeling sorry for themselves because they were deceptive, the death. I feel like this person, interesting, this person might be dealing with some kind of death. If not a death, this person is going through some kind of very intense spiritual transformation, a very intense spiritual crisis. And I feel like they're recognizing everybody around them 
um, is our devil's judgment. Like, I feel like not only this person, but everybody that had a hand in this person treating you this way. I feel like people, their community, their family was like, yeah, yeah, do that. Yeah, do that. Yeah, do, do, do. You know, like, it was like very fun to um, make you feel a certain way or to have you rejected or something. Okay. But now these people are chained to the devil. Eight of swords again. These people are being haunted and I'm, I'm hearing haunted by the, by the ghost of you. Like I feel like your higher self or uh, your God or your gods or whatever is like really doing a number on these people. Okay. Who does that? Like somebody, somebody literally like made you, not made you Tencent because you chose this. Somebody like really, like, gave you false promises and were like, yeah, no, like, we're going to be happy and we're going to, like, do a chicka chi chicka chicka ta And then when you were like, okay, let's do this, they rejected you. Like, I, I feel like I'm also repeating that scenario over and over because it's like, what the fuck? Like, what? I don't feel like you're feeling like that as in, like, 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 because it's unexpected or anything. It's just like, what? Ew. That's the energy I'm getting here. Like, I feel like some of you are also like, I compromised this much for this? For this person? For this person whose breath probably even smells like fucking snot? Is what I'm hearing? <laughs> this person, I don't know. For some reason, I feel like this person, it could look like they're, 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 they're they, I don't know. It just looks like they're very gross. Like, all of a sudden, I feel like they're very gross. Like, you might be seeing this person as very gross, okay? I keep hearing you lowered your standards, like, exponentially. One, two, three. This is like an angel falling in love with, with the devil, with the demon. Being like, I don't care. Like, I love you nonetheless. And then, I don't know, maybe they were on some kind of ego trip or something. And they were like, ha, ha fuck you and everybody around them was also like yeah do that yeah that like that's yeah this is gonna be so funny and <clears throat> lame princess of cups the tower reverse and the king of pentacles reverse this is this is some kind of missed opportunity i feel the queen of pentacles i feel like this person had an opportunity to be in a very abundant relationship with you we know this the collective is the one that has the new beginnings the collective is the one that is the new beginning right you are wish fulfillment right and now this person is stuck because they know that they missed out on their wish fulfillment <laughs> excuse me but they actively did this 12 12 and i feel like this person also knows this person and these people also know that you are about to go on some kind of new beginning. You're about to meet somebody new. You maybe recently did meet somebody new. Something like that. I feel like this person... Uh, I'm hearing, oh my god, this person has a lot of victim consciousness. Because all of a sudden, I'm like... Like, they're like angry at their family or whatever. But all of a sudden, I just feel like... I just feel like I, I just started this reading. But this person is in a lot of victim consciousness. Interesting. Um, because they're like um, very sad and very like down and out. And they're like very like, oh my God, I can't keep watching them. It hurts too much. But they did this on purpose. Like they, I don't know, they like cut their nose. And then they're like, oh my God, what the fuck? You know, something like that. They cut their own nose to spite their face or some shit like that, right? Anyway, Collective, that was your reading. Please do consider liking and subscribing. And we'll see you again for another one. Southern Bye.